Hey guys, Clint and Dave here. The Daredevil trailer for the Netflix slash Marvel series drops today. And it looks pretty rad. It looks great. Oh yeah. man, I'm so psyched about this. You know, I think that this this Netflix thing is really amazing. I mean, they do high quality shows, but we weren't sure yet, right? We know we're right. doing. We know they're going to do four. And Daredevil also is a little dicey. Think about like the Ben Affleck movie, it's right? Got, it's it's uh, it's got a little baggage. This trailer was unbelievable. It was really good. Here's wow. here's the. The first thing that I noticed from it was was just the quality of it, the texture of it felt oh, yeah. so much more film-like yeah. than than either Agents of Shield or uh, Agent Carter. Mm -hmm. Because it's a smaller street level show like the rest of the Netflix series are gonna be, they have the advantage of just being able to use actual sets in New York, actual places in New York instead yeah. of having to like you know, build flying cars that look exactly. a little cheesy because it's on a TV budget. You exactly. Know, so. Everything has a little gleam on it. Yeah, sort of. yeah, yeah. yeah. I hate to use the word gritty because I feel like they would always use gritty to describe stuff that wasn't anything but gritty. But sure. this, I think this is appropriate for this. I mean, I love that shot. They did a teaser of the tease like uh, the other day yeah. and they just had the one shot of him like, you know, standing in the, in the like, apartment or whatever and hearing through the right. wall and that stuff looks so amazing and i love the shot of like you know all of his senses how he sort of like can feel everything and i i'm really excited to see when they actually show his um his view right you know his echolocation and, yeah. and how they're going to do that if they're going to mimic the comic book this trailer showing up and looking really cool um gets me even more excited about the rest of the, the netflix oh, yeah. series too. aka jessica jones has been getting a really cool cast together yeah. they just added carrie and moss the other yeah. day and then and Daredevil itself has a really great cast. Mm -hmm. Charlie Cox is great. Uh, Vincent D'Onofrio, the one shot yes. that we saw of Kingpin from behind looking at like just a blank canvas, I mm -hmm. guess, in an art in an art gallery. Uh, just seeing Kingpin from behind. Like, yeah. That was I was like, oh, sweet. He's uh, a badass. And I also think that a lot of the Marvel movies haven't been that edgy. Mm -hmm. And I think that this will sort of allow for that. I feel like these Netflix series are gonna be way darker than these big movies right. because they can get away with it. They already have the deal with Netflix and the money's already there. And frankly, like they don't have to have like a billion dollars worth of profit from these. And, and that's what that's what the Netflix audience expects too. Mm -hmm. And that's the other thing that's been really impressive about Marvel in general is how malleable they are. How yeah. how because they can go in and do a political thriller with Winter Soldier and do it really well. They can go in and do a space opera with Guardians of the Galaxy and do it really well. They can do uh, you know network TV really well. Uh, and then now they're doing like a gritty pay cable. Yeah. Really well, you yeah. know, like this could have been on HBO as well, and it totally. would have felt right at home. Yeah, I agree. You know, I also think they're really. It feels real Frank Miller Daredevil too. You know, it feels really dark. Yeah. It feels like you know he's he's an uber Catholic. You know, we you know because right. he's going in there and confessing. And I love the fact that they went with his like first costume. Uh, Dread Pir Pirate yeah, Roberts. Yeah, exactly. Kind of yeah, look, yeah, yeah. From the Man Without Fear, and I think you know that looks really cool. I love he's got a red trim. I wonder if he's going to end up in the red costume by the end, or if they're going to keep it more like that, or maybe the costume he. Has had when he was like leader of the hand where it's like black with you know the red dirt there's so much cool stuff that could happen and you know it's gonna look really good and the action felt really good too because we know that steve yeah. Knight, who's the guy who's running the show you know he was one of the dudes on spartacus right you know and, and it felt like even that they did a little small montage of action but it seemed really impactful and really well, cool. even just the jumping in between the uh the the crates the shipping crates yeah uh, there with like the guns going off around him and he you know he's fighting a little bit and um so i mean it, it it's all it all looks incredibly capable done and the feel of it just felt great. And I also think Daredevil is great because he's so vulnerable compared to a lot of these other Marvel superheroes we've had. You know, he's not covered in an iron suit. Right. He doesn't have a super soldier serum. He can just sense things better and that's it. Other than that, he can get his ass kicked. Well, and they showed, right off the top of the trailer, they showed him sort of getting out of bed real gingerly with, like, bruises and scars yeah. and cuts and everything. So it's like, he's he's gonna get his ass kicked a, yes. a, a handful of times, I'm sure. And Scott Glenn looks awesome as stick. Blind Love eyes. It. Oh, man. He's got the milky cataract thing going on. Yeah! Ugh, anything Scott Glenn is in is great. Yes. That's not a completely true statement. No. But, I mean, Backdraft was really good. Yeah. So, let us know what you think of the trailer of Daredevil. Obviously, we're very excited about it. Uh, let us know. And click like and subscribe. Come back next time for more movie news on Cinefix Now. Which is something I haven't said in like three weeks. I know, it's been forever, Between right? Sundance and the tournament, we haven't done anything. Well, this is a good return. The Daredevil trailer? Come on! We're back, everybody! We're a YouTube show with no fear! <laughs>